I note that there are no patients in hospital and there are 25 of the 43 cases that have made a full recovery. So I think that's good news for, for this community. But as well as that, as it's a demonstration of the discipline of this community, there has been a 75% reduction uh, of people on the roads compared with last Easter. And I think that's, that's really, really important. So always remember, I think, once again to stay at home, make absolutely sure that we get on top of this. I, uh, myself and uh, this council couldn't be more proud of what in fact is happening, the discipline of this community. Can I also um, say how you know, pleased we are with the general community in Toowoomba in terms of complying uh, with the Chief Health Officer's directives? Uh, we saw great compliance over the weekend and we saw you know, people were still able to you know, enjoy the company of their, their family. Had to have two people come to their address. Uh, they were going out for necessities. Still celebrating Easter. Some people camped out at home on Saturday night, so it was really great to see. So, again, can I thank the local community for their support and their compliance with the directive? Uh, it's very important to our whole community. We did, um, you know, provide some warnings and some guidance to some people, um, but those people complied very quickly. So, this is about everyone understanding that it's everyone's responsibility to make sure that we don't you know, breach the directive so we don't put people at risk. So we don't put older people at risk. We, you know, our, our parents, our uncles, our aunts, our fr friends, our neighbours. It's about making sure we protect the community. I join with the Mayor and uh, Superintendent Mark Kelly in congratulating people across the uh, Toowoomba Darling Downs region, of course, uh, across Australia, in fact, uh, for adhering to those tough uh, movement restrictions established by the National Cabinet, uh, represented in our case obviously by the Prime Minister and the Premier of Queensland. Uh, the fact is that across Australia, over Easter, we have saved lives by people following those strict movement restrictions. So congratulations and uh, thank you to all residents in our local region for doing just that. The challenge remains. Uh, we will be uh, in, a, in a state of uh, challenge for quite some months yet, so Australians must continue to work together.